Jetbricks here. Today we're gonna be opening up five packs of the LEGO Movie 2 minifigure series. Technically one of them's already opened up, but that was like right, literally right after my last one. It I found this one on the ground and I opened it for some reason. But we're gonna open up that one first. But this should complete my series. So let's open this one up first. Alright, let's open up this pack. And it will technically just pour out who's inside, and it's a awesome remix Emmett. I know a lot of people are gonna be commenting how I just decided to only put the legs, the torso, the cup, the face, and the hairpiece in there, not the phone and the base plate. But yeah, the the phone was on the ground next to me. But you know, but this is a duplicate. I already have one of these before. But honestly, I don't mind getting a second one of this. I really like this figure. I love his face print and I love his hat hair combo. You can see in the back of his face print right there. And I love his accessory. In fact, I actually might put that hair piece on my sick pig. You never know. Okay, so here's our second pack. And, well, I just completely just de demolished that. And this one, oh, I see how they resealed them now. This one is the Scarecrow. So yeah, if you're wondering how I bought these, I just bought these off eBay, just like resealed ones. So I having to go back to the Lego store and getting more of them. But uh, yeah, it's just like, it was just such an easier process. So here's the Scarecrow, and I actually really like this figure. It's one of my favorites of the series. I do like his printed 2x2 two two tile, which says Certificate of Achievement. And I love his torso and leg printing. Probably no dual hold legs, but does he really need them? He does have no alternate face expression. Really nice one as well. But uh, the best part is his awesome new hat piece, which is completely new to the character. And it fits perfectly for him, so spot on for sure. Alright, so here's our third pack. And yeah, let's see, I'm trying to get this open so when I go to review them, they're not open, so. And this one is Cowardly Lion. Again, Cowardly Lion is one of my favorites of the series. He does have this nice 2x2 metal, and I love, 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 love his new, uh, what is this, uh, main piece? And just like the sculpting on that is just amazing. He does have a really accurate face print, and even a back face print, which I really like how they went out for that, and even went out and put some more printing on him and even printing on the legs and even on the feet. So, a really good figure, one of my favorites of the series of a really iconic movie. Two packs left, this one must be the watermelon guy because this one's really thick. And, I'm trying to get this open, there it goes. And yep, this is the watermelon. It's actually really, really nice. I thought he was a really bland figure at first, but I think this one's actually really good. Um, I do like his dual mold legs with the white and pink. It just thinks he has like that green, but he does not. I do like his plain dual mold legs with the green, and he does come with an extra piece of one of these watermelons, which is new for 2019. It does have a new face print and back face print. One of my favorite parts of this entire figure, honestly, and the watermelon piece itself is really nice as well. I think they did an excellent job. And just you could point out how this could be used for like a pizza slice in like a series 19, which I think actually works really well. I think that would actually work out well. That was just my other watermelon piece. This is blue out the sand. And so this one is going to be a Tim Man. Just count on it, okay? I mean, if it isn't, I'm actually going to complain. And yeah, it is. Here it is, right there. And so here's the Tin Man and design of him. This is another really perfect minifigure. I think they nailed this design. The axe is the same one from the LEGO City 2019 sets. And the face and torso and legs is really nice gun metal gray coloring. It has this really nice shine to it. It has a nice uh, new piece for the head or like the cap thing he wears. And the heart is the same heart piece that Sweet Mayhem uses and the Sweet Mayhem's to start Starship set. There are sets like that. And also does come with an extra one of those. And even the the best part here is like you see like the what is it? Like the bow tie piece. They not include one, but two extras of these. 
I don't know if that was just mine, but like that, that's really nice. But yeah, a really cool figure overall. So the figures we got were an awesome remix of Emmett, the Scarecrow, the Cowardly Lion, the Watermelon Guy, and the Tin Man. Now, this is a pretty good selection. I actually, some of my favorite figures are in this bunch, including the Emmett, which is the only duplicate here because that's not the only, that's the only one I didn't buy off eBay. But yeah, now let's take a look at all my series because I think, yeah, I'm done with the series now. So now I've completely finished the minifigure series, so expect a full review soon. And yeah, I think this is a pretty good selection of minifigures overall. But yeah, that's it for this unbagging. I can't I expect a review actually tomorrow to celebrate the movie. So yeah, that's it for this video. Make sure to like it and subscribe if you're new, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Till then, peace out. Bye.